at some point, I really, really hope that I get to see boobs. <laughs> Right, what's going on everyone it is jack we're gonna be checking out season one episode three of atypical today this episode's called julia says and i don't know if i'm gonna read the description for every episode uh because i don't want to be spoiled on too much but uh this one says that sam decides to update his look casey learns a family secret and feeling like her family no longer needs her elsa seeks attention elsewhere i don't like the sound of that if you're uh, if you're new here, make sure that you uh, hit that subscribe button so you know every time I upload a video. And if you want access to early and uncut videos for Atypical, the 100, Vikings, and Walking Dead, among other shows, make sure to check out my Patreon down below. And I say without further ado, let's jump right into this episode of Atypical. <laughs> ah, that's loud. You worried about the regionals? I know Clayton Prep has that one speedy Mexican girl, but I know you could beat her. Are you offended because I called her Mexican? Because she actually is. I kissed a boy. Wow. All right. That's something. She makes me feel like a loser. Wow. That's your uh, All right. first kiss, huh? That's, that's a big deal. You're like running farther away from me. You're moving your arms No, I'm not. I'm just gangly. It's just, <laughs> it's I'm how just I run. gangly. He's about to be weird about it. Who, 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 who is this boy? What kind of homework yes. do they give you at the tech school? Can he fix our AC? Can we stop talking about this? Casey? That's a, that's a good way to make your dad keep up. <laughs> Tell him about a boy you're into or a great way to keep your mom up. Or have your mom keep up. Because we're not machines. It's a hard lesson to learn, but it's a true one. The best thing that you can say about practice is that it makes better. That's a good quote. Good boyfriend to Julia. Sam. I need a practice girlfriend first. Oh. Oh my gosh. I feel these routines though. Oh no. Mm. Don't you answer that text. That's a very detailed calendar. Why does my to-do list say remove stick from butt? I don't know. But if it's on there, you gotta do it, right? You guys need fuel after your run? <laughs> I made cinnamon bun. Boop. Hey, back, buddy. hey I'm going to the mall later. Does anybody This is need literally anything? my family dynamic. No, Mom. But thanks for everything you do. B E E. Oh. She was nice and explained it to me. Oh, that's that's nice. the first joke I ever learned. Oh. That's a little close, hey, Sam. Madison, be mine. Would you like to go on a date with me? That's so nice, but I'm busy. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, he took that well. I was going to say he took that well. Not really. Wait, I, I didn't tell you when the date is. Friday, 6 p.m. Eastern. I'm still busy. <laughs> okay. I also forgot to tell you that you would be my practice Sam. Girlfriend. The person I really like is Julia, my therapist, if that makes it any better. If Friday is bad, I could do Thursday instead. Oh my god, I don't want to go out with you. I need new clothes. I guess so they could get a sense of your style. It says something about a person. Like how some iguanas flare their colorful dewlaps to attract a mate. Exactly. Like sure. That. There are so many clothes and, and different <sighs> I colors feel and that. patterns and sizes. I think there's a stylish dude in there. You mean me, right? I do. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Are uh, you doing great, man? So, uh, oh, he's he a, a paramedic. Boyfriend. Nice. Uh, I'm sure I got nothing to worry about. That's the same thing I said about my daughter. It's fun being a grandfather. <laughs> I like it. That escalated very quickly. Elsa, no. No. It's just so much easier if I go to the mall by myself. But Julia says what? I need to learn how to do my own shopping for when I live by myself one day. It was so overwhelming with all the oh, sounds no. and the lights and, and then you can shop from the comfort of home. Pretty great idea, right? No. Mom, 
I'm not a little kid anymore. He's I, right. I can go shopping. I can do things. Hey, you want to help me put away the rest of the groceries? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, I, I relate too much. Eugenic family. Yeah, we can gross oh, we are. Man. That's so, great. so nice. <laughs> Dad's gonna walk in, I bet. Or the mom, one of the two. Hey, uh, what? don't wipe nice your mouth. You, sir. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> stopping by. Uh, geez, her cheeks are uh, red. Dad, why weren't you at the autism walk in 2004? Well, I don't need you to, he is. Oh, Evan, <laughs> drive? Yes. Really? How's your driving record? Oh, it's clean. No parking tickets? <laughs> no traffic violations? And parole? He None stole a tuba. Casey. Was that a <laughs> tuba? We should probably get going. Oh uh, my man, god. You, you should get going. Dad. <laughs> yeah, I'll be in the Protective car. dad initiated. <laughs> yeah, I don't want you to do anything to screw up your track career. I'm not. Track is important to oh, me too. Is it? Yeah, stop acting like a lunatic. We're going to talk about that tuba thing later too. Hmm. I feel like there's more behind that. Or there's not. It was just a point to make the conversation okay. awkward. If I drive too fast, pieces fall off. <laughs> So, that was weird with your dad, right? Him lying about missing the autism walk. Why do you think that he's lying? Maybe not, but I've got a lot of experience with lying fathers. My dad would lie. Okay, Stop they're making it a bigger he's the only one in my family that plot gets line. And honestly, if he's acting a little aggro, we're honest with each other. Good. It's good. Oh, dear. He didn't lie. Hmm. He's okay. growing up, Elsa. Great. Okay. Let him well, be. Um, Zahid's here. I invited Zahid because he's the most stylish person I know. Sometimes he wears two watches. Oh. I'ma be as stylish as Zahid, and I'ma wear two watches too. You smell amazing. Um. Oh, Zahid, hey, Sam, stop this it. would look very handsome on you. Well, screw Julia. Ooh. <clears throat> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say that out loud. No, I get it, Mama. She bugs. <laughs> I once worked with a guy like that. Pull down my drawers and plop my nut brown bottom on his car. Nut brown bottom. And um, what did that do? Sam, let's get you into a dressing room. I mean. Okay. I'm, I'm Elsa. I can just go in here. All right. Let's El get rid of this Elsa. Mr. Rogers shit your mom picked out. Party shirts first, bro. Specifically, a private dressing room. Yes, and I said I'd see what I could do. Uh -huh. Turns out I couldn't do anything. <laughs> Sorry, we're just in the middle. Sorry. You know, I just no, don't understand that... why you didn't say, I'm sorry, ma'am, but I can't help you. Cause I'll say that next time. Elsa, you're being a little demand. <gasps> oh, boy. Do I have a feeling we're getting close. Trust me, leather jackets are chick magnets. I wore they one of these are... to a current wedding shower and got a two-hour foot massage from the bride's cousin. But the hot enough one. The hot enough it doesn't one. feel like me. You're trying to get girls. The last thing you want to be is yourself. I'm taking it Zaheed. all. Zahid. Trust me, Sam. That's not a not good like I'm mindset. The moon here. I mean, Elsa. all I'm asking that's so loud and people like jostling by, you know? Ma'am. Did you just hit yeah, her? Did you just push me? What? No, I was you... demonstrating. This is oh, it. this is going for. Great. It's 100% cotton, which is my favorite percentage of cotton, and it has eight Antarctic on it, which is a higher number than I've seen on any other shirt. Basically for being a good mom. So here's my credit card. El you know, buy two or three things, and I'll meet you out front. That, that was the whole point of coming? Of course. Of course. Oh. <laughs> and Julia knew about this? I love the, like, secret service level of security he has with, like, the earpiece and shit. Girls, huh? Where? <laughs> no, I just mean. Um, um yes. Of course. Aren't you afraid of getting hurt? Of course, Ooh. but that's love. Not unless I date a great white shark. <laughs> no, I, I know what you mean. You mean my feelings, <sighs> right? Yeah. Feelings I get also why she reason. is. In fight or flight, right? Worried. It's like but... if I'm walking down a dark alley. At some point, I really, really hope that I get to see boobs. <laughs> You know, we should get it's not six really more pillows for each. that. That way we could both throw our own six pillows off the bed. My parents have so many excess pillows, oh. too. I mean, to be fair, I do, too. I got six pillows. Technically, nine if you count the body pillow. Uh, I have another pillow and then a side pillow. I'm always nice. Mm, 
my day. I'm not supposed to be telling this, but Casey has some sort of boyfriend. I read all her texts. Oh, that's okay. not cool. I'm sure some sad, insecure girl will crush on you someday deep in the very far future. I feel you, I Casey. Wish. That's what happened in my now. life. Hey, Sam, not this Siri. is random, but um, do you know why Dad wasn't at the first Autism Awareness Walk? That's the year he left us. Uh, what? What do you mean he left us? Like he moved out of the house? Yes, for eight months. Are you sure? How could he do that? Packed his clothes and drove off. What? <laughs> There's got to be more to that. That's a... Huh. Oh, shit. Is Casey, like, ditching? Oh, no. Gonna miss track practice and everything. Oh, don't go talk to her. No, 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 please. Oh. Is she actually gonna do what Zahid said? If she does, it's not that bad. I'm just hoping she doesn't do something, like, reckless, like, break a window. Oh, my God. Keep ignoring those texts. That's a beater car if I've ever seen one. I just, I, I can't believe that my dad would leave us. Does he have like a whole other family somewhere else? I should have never said anything. No, I mean, I'm glad that I know. Yeah. I just, I thought that we were so close. Like who abandons their family? And last year he stole my identity. What? I don't know if everything he's saying is just bullshit, or if he just has a really shitty life. He's okay. a really fun well, actor. Thank you, thank you for calling, I appreciate it. Go to Kennedy Park. That's where they hang out. Oh, Let's go no. By Let's kill him. T take it easy, Chuck. No, we're gonna kill him. Chapter 8. <laughs> Photosynthesis. 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 It molts. Oh, Sam. When a snake is feeling oh, I feel you, split, Sam. it sheds. I have almost that exact same jacket, and it is quite uh, obnoxious. You're supposed to buckle the buckle, but uh... uh... Many of the organisms called... Sometimes you have to get rid of your outer layer. Uh, Sam? Yes, Ms. Jablonski? Is everything okay? <laughs> yes, thank you. Is everything okay with you? Yes, I'm fine. That's okay. great. That's good. Yeah. Well, rip. Are you gonna ask why? I know why, because of this little asshole, right? I thought you hey, said hey, was hey. distracted. I'm not distracted by him. I'm distracted by you. I know that you left us for eight months. E Casey. Yikes. So, call <laughs> <stole> a tuba? <laughs> <laughs> News spreads fast. Casey, it's not something I'm very proud of. <sighs> okay? You know, it was hard when your brother was born. It was hard having a son who didn't smile and look you in the eye. Things would get better and he would grow out of it and then he was diagnosed and, you know, mom threw herself in all of it with the support groups and the special diets and she was great. And I felt like I was just messing things up. So I left. It wasn't your fault and it wasn't mom That's and Sam, it was me. heavy, man. I can't believe that you left us. I know, but I'm sorry, okay? And you know, I love you more than anything. I want to leave every single day. Can you tell me we're good? Yeah. We're good, Dad. Are you, though? I don't know if I believe that. We'll I'm see. I'm acting erratically. I know that. I don't know who I am anymore. I don't know who needs me. Hi! I, I like your shirt. Are you being sarcastic? <gasps> oh, no. Oh! Someone no, likes you. the shirt! Oh! Certainly not. Sam! Sam, that was a sign! I don't, I don't know. know what I want. I don't know what's coming next. That's odd. Or what to expect. That it wouldn't get seen until now. Well, I don't know how long it's been, but... Oh, get it. Chill with the duck face. Oh my god. Oh, come on. Everything is changing. No! And I'm not so good without my routines. You ready to go, Casey? I'm gonna kick your butt. Well, this family is in shambles right now.
Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, that was... There was some very interesting developments in this episode. My goodness. Um, so, the mom. Cheating ho on the fam. Not okay with that. I'm not trying to, like, rank shitty deeds by the fam, but that's definitely worse than leaving because you feel like you're not helping. Because if you feel like you're doing more damage than help and you leave to try to get your head straight, as long as he, like, told the mom or the, his wife about it, I expect we're probably going to get some more information about it, but cheating is... I, I live in a very black and white world, as fellow people on the spectrum will know, so infidelity is not something that I take lightly, and I'm not, I'm not a fan of that, so. Uh, she, she has dropped to near the bottom of the list, the characters that I'm a fan of right now. Like, I almost even like the girl that was... Bullying the thick girl. I almost, I almost like the mom less than her. That's saying something because I hate bullying too. Well, yeah, there's a, there's a lot of interesting stuff going on right now. I like that Sam's being more independent. Um, in fact, just recently I went through every single drawer in my bedroom and got rid of a bunch of shit and uh because of the quarantine i can't really just go out and get new stuff right now but soon probably <sighs> hopefully casey can um cope with this okay i don't think it'll weigh on her too much because she does understand why he left but it doesn't make it any easier considering the fact she didn't really even remember it it didn't have that much of an impact but still learning about it has clearly had an effect so it's understandable but um the stuff with sam and julia it's it's funny but it's also like really concerning like i'm hoping that he doesn't really i'm hoping he drops that soon and there was a girl that was um a girl that complimented his shirt after Casey was like, no, nah, it looks so stupid. It's like, nah, there's people that might like it, man. And as long as you like it and it's not like dirty or potentially harmful to other people, then forget what other people think. Because as long as you're happy, that's what matters. And, uh, so who knows? Maybe that girl will be a friend to him someday and... Oh, you won't be so cool as if she was into penguins too. Oh, that'd be so cool. Uh, I recognize her from something. I don't know what. She had to have been on some some other show or movie. But yeah, that was uh, that was season one, episode three of Atypical. And uh, as I said before, my DMs on Instagram and Twitter are open if. Want to talk about spectrum stuff or have questions anything like that feel free to hit me up uh yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this reaction and as i said before if you want to get the full uncut reactions for atypical sometimes early as well check out my patreon down below and as always this has been jack from group of gamers inc i'm out peace double watch gang so she's she with Sam. more than one Sorry. person at once. What the Sam. fuck? And Sam. Jesus Christ! Because she's a skank. Are you joking? So you're doing research? You psycho little bitch! I don't think so. No, no, no. He means B. No! I'm not a fan of cat. What kind of girl you looking for, Sam? You crazy little bitch! I don't care right now! No, I don't care! You little crazy. That's gonna be my demons. 
Are you kidding me? Okay, you didn't have to say it like that. They just killed him like that? I appreciate you saying something, but that was the worst thing you could have said. 